Top story breaking news. A man found shot to death inside a downtown Vancouver business, leaving some in that area very worried tonight. That business is Bullion Precious Metals at the corner of 7th and Main. Our Chris Woodard has been there all afternoon. He's live now with the latest. What's the newest, Chris? Yeah, police are still out here conducting their investigation on the scene tonight, but we did just find that they are now calling this a homicide. They say they are pursuing leads and trying to track down a suspect, and that is the news that neighboring business owners have been fearing all day. I mean, it's unheard of down here. As police walk the area, eager to uncover more information about a man found dead inside this precious metal shop, some neighboring business owners are uneasy. I guess just nowadays you're just concerned. I mean, it doesn't make a whole lot of difference what the business is. I mean, they come in what, and rob somebody and shoot them for 50 bucks, 20 bucks. Shortly before noon, someone noticed a man inside this shop and ran across the street to a store and asked them to call 911. Police arrived and found one man shot dead inside the metal shop and say no one else was in the store at the time. Major crimes is on scene, but we don't know if it was self-inflicted or if it's uh, treated as a homicide. It's a suspicious death this time. That's all I have. The neighbor who called 911 tells me he saw the body on the floor and the door to the shop was unlocked. Several neighboring business owners tell us they fear the man dead is the man who ran that metal shop, usually alone. There's only one person there, which yeah, I wouldn't run this business with one person. At this point, police do not know when that shooting occurred, and one neighbor says she was told someone thought they heard a gunshot last night, and it could be possible that man lay dead inside the store for hours. And again, while police were unsure earlier today, we did just learn that this is being considered a homicide, and they are pursuing leads trying to find a suspect tonight. We will be here and we'll continue to give you updates as we learn more information. But at this point, police still not identifying the victim and not confirming whether or not it is the man who ran that shop, which is what these neighboring business owners fear. Live in Vancouver, I'm Chris Woodard for Coin 6 News. Again.